good evening from my time, everyone. How are you doing tonight, today, whatever time it is for you guys? Hope you guys are doing well. It is time to continue with some more... Well, for me, anyway, I really want to play this. Baldur's Gate 3. Um, I know I've played Tomb Raider last night, um, but I really wanted to play some more of this. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll make my way back to uh, Tomb Raider at some point. Um, probably next week, maybe. Uh, but I just really wanted to continue this, so... We're gonna we're gonna load this up. Um, we're gonna continue to Vulcan's journey through this game. Hope you guys enjoy it. I know I have been so far, so. Even if you can't be seen, some criminal acts can be overheard. Hide to reduce the noise. Well, I don't plan on being a whole lot of, uh, mean. Uh, I think the game's got to load in a little bit. There it goes. Yeah, okay. I got some... I mean, I am loading off of a disc, so I understand that's going to be the cause of this. Price I pay to have this 180 something gig game installed. Pretty sure it's that big. Doesn't say how big it is. But, you know, make sure the game audio is working. Doesn't seem to be. Let me fix that real quick. Still not working. Well, that's working now. Okay, so if I click off, you guys can hear it. Okay. That's fine. I'll have to fix that later. Okay. So I think I wanted to go in through the stone door. Oh, that's right. Alright, we're in the stone door. Dang it. I don't want to do. Best be on my way. Got some people arguing over here. When we cast out the red. Ooh, a snake. Please. I'm sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? Oof. I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. Kaga seems to be a real piece of work. To reject the helpless is to reject Sylvanas herself. Himself. Yeah. What is this girl's actual crime? Yeah, there you go. Girl. You mean parasite? She eats our food, drinks our water. Then steals our most holy idol in thanks. She probably didn't Wrath, mean it. Lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Tila is restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely. Do it. Okay, let's see. Nature. Total plus one. Persuasion plus three. Persuasion. Oh, okay, different sayings. Okay. So we've got... And I should have enabled this thing, too. Um, you guys can interact with the stream, I'm hoping. Actually, let me make sure that works really quick here. Go to my 
my channel here and make sure this thing is working. Yes, okay, so yep, it should be working. Over the over the left, oh, the once you have it enabled, um, then you can be able to go to the left side of the screen and uh, you can interact with the party. Has not received any game data yet. Uh, maybe I have to wait to turn that on. Um, options interface gameplay, maybe. Oh, let's turn that to Imperial. That's what I'm used to. Yes, enable Twitch integration. Okay, now that should work. Let me make sure. Yes, so now you guys can access the uh, the party, seeing who's in the party so far. Um, you can see the quests that I'm currently on. And stuff like that. I think you can also interact with like choices that I have. Yeah, like I could do a community poll for it. You guys could choose for it. I believe that works. Oh, yep. See, there you go. Yeah, so you guys can vote for options. Like you could do that. I just voted myself for option three, so I can see that 100% of people have chosen option three so far. Hold oh, on, I'm about to sneeze. <sighs> no, it wasn't a sneeze, it was a cough. But okay, so we have 100% options for choosing uh, this one. So we'll go ahead and pick that one. Ooh, I get an advantage on it. And it's a D10 uh, difficulty class. Uh, DC of 10. That's what it was. Click the dice to roll. Okay. Ooh, 19. Which gives us a total of 22. All right. The words of the tree father. They both approve. Good. It is as you say. Sifisif, deal out to me. Out, thief. My grace has its limits. Good, everybody approves. It hurts. Ooh, what hurts? Thank you, Korga. Master Halsin. Halsin isn't here. Keep his name off your tongue, lest Tila pierce it. I don't know. I hate wolves. Oh. I didn't realize you were frightened of wolves, Shadow. Everyone's frightened of something. That's a nice little interaction. It's hardly irrational when you see the fangs on those things. Can I talk to them? That woman has more venom in her heart than a snake in its fangs. But at least the child is oh, safe. Oh, wow. What is you? We are having it's some frame drops here. Forgiven um, for one's transgressions. I wonder if it's because of something else I've got going on here. Does that help any? Seems to help a little bit. What is youth if not time to be forgiven for one's transgressions? Yeah? Forgiveness doesn't mean anything. It doesn't mean learn from mistakes. Come, let's cut the kid some slack, shall we? She didn't deserve this madcap spectacle I mean, as far she, as I'm she, concerned. Learn from her mistakes, but not necessarily like, you know. I know that look. Punish You're her wondering why by killing I was in her. Pain before. Let's just clear the air about that now. It's just an old wound that hurts me from time to time. Nothing to be concerned about. It's nothing to do with the tadpoles, at least, in case your imagination is in danger of getting away from you. It's just something I have to live with. How badly does it hurt? Quite a lot, if I'm being honest. But it always passes quickly, so I can manage. Okay, I think I fixed the, uh, the frame rate problem. 
She says not. If she says it's not related to the tadpoles, I'm gonna trust her. Tell me about your fear of wolves. They're ravenous predators with fangs like daggers. It's hardly an irrational fear to harbor. Don't be surprised if I'm reluctant to face any more. Everyone's got fears. I won't judge yours. Really? Some might think it makes me a liability. I mean, I've got a fear of. In the case, it's not something. I actually, I don't know what my fears are, honestly. But I'll say this guy's fears are, you know, big slimy things in your eye. <clears throat> we think of all that's happened to us so far. Likely more to come. Care to narrow it down a little? I must have thoughts that are about stowaways. Oh yeah. Must I? Thinking about it won't help. We know what to do, so let's do it. Find a way to rid ourselves of these things. Personally, I think finding this Halsin is our best bet. If we're truly desperate, we can try to convince that goblin gut in assisting us. Yeah, I don't want to do that, no. What will you do if you actually manage to ruin the tadpoles? I suppose we'd go our separate ways. Not a slight on your company, of course. Um, where would you go? Home. Baldur's Gate. There's someone waiting for me there. Someone I have to reach. As soon as possible. Seems personal. I won't pry if it's not something you want to talk about. Thank you. And you're right. It's a delicate matter. Not something for light conversation. Um, yep, that's good. Okay. So now we wanted to talk to Kaga. I should speak up. <clears throat> Go on. Say it. You think I'm a monster? Monster? Too kind. Oh shit. <laughs> a demon more like. Only a monster would threaten a child. Kind from other circles. You see only villains and victims. A viper bears her fangs, defending her brood. I call her mother. You call her monster. There's a no <clears throat> there's a difference between I took back someone defending their Sylvanus, their own and actually going out to you know murder and free from harm, pillage. Free of intruders. Oh, we got some options here. Six options to choose from. Matter took back the idol Sophanus. You cast out the guiltless, you shame your order. A disease of the flower must not reach the root. Pluck the petals, sever the branch if you must. But cut out the rot before it infects the whole of the wood. Teachings of the Tree Father. Do you agree? I know the Tree Father's teachings as well as you. Then you know I heed his wisdom. I protect the circle, whatever the cost. You showed great metal at the gate. The metal of a skilled sword for hire. I want you to provide your services to Sevlor. Offer to guide the Outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the Viper must strike. Then it seems I must, I'd best speak to Zevlor. You will do more than speak. This tale ends but one way. With the Outlander rot cleansed, and the grove forever shrouded. She's a bitch. Tiring business, isn't it? All this traveling and adventuring. Why don't we take a little break? Hmm? Allow ourselves a few moments of rest? 
gives me a chance to talk to you about something, well, rather important. Rather important, no less? All right, go ahead. We've been on the road together for a while now, haven't we? Not really that long, but all right. Barrels, overcame some obstacles. Ever since you were kind enough to free me from that stone, I've seen you demonstrate We've had one remarkable fight. guile and courage. The way you stood in front of a crossbow to prevent a murder. The way you got Korga to release the girl. In short, I've grown to oh, I guess those you. two things happened, huh? Enough with the flattery. Where is this going? I was being quite sincere, I assure you. Oh. The reason I make a point of saying this is that I've grown confident enough to tell you something I've yet to tell another living soul. Except for my cat. You see, I have this condition. Very different from the parasite we share, but just as deadly. Mm, what kind of condition? The specifics are rather personal, but suffice it to say that it is a malady I've learned to live with. Though not without some effort. What it comes down to is this. Every so often, I need to get my hands on a powerful magical item and absorb the weave inside. Wouldn't that ruin the item? Trust me when I say, the loss of the occasional wizard staff or tome of enchantment is a bargain given the cost of allowing me to deteriorate. It's been days since I last consumed an artifact, since before we were abducted. It's only a matter of time before my craving returns. That is why I turn to you. I need you to help me find magic items to consume. It is vital. Dare I say it? Critical. I fail to see why you need me to help you with this. You've done fine without me so far. A fair point. However, until recently, I was able to rely on a supply of artifacts stored in my tower in Waterdeep. A supply that has now run dry. We're also not in Waterdeep. The reality of the matter is that a lone wizard with a chronic impairment such as my own is not in the most ideal of situations with regards to self-defense. The manner of artifacts I need are not often found waiting patiently on a shopkeep's shelf. One usually has to lift them delicately from trap-filled tombs or prize them from the hands of violent ne'er-do-wells. There'll be danger involved. Or great cost. Honestly, that sounds terrible. I see no upside to this for me. Then I suggest you look closer. Having a wizard like me around is quite the boon when facing the perils that stalk these lands. It'd be far harder for me to assist you if I could barely stand upright. Please, trust me. Your help could be the difference between life and death. All right, I'll use my uh, wisdom to use my tadpole to seek the danger. DC is only 10. Ooh, yeah, there we go. 22. You become one in Gale's mind, and you can feel something sinister oppressing you. It's inside of you. A mighty darkness radiating from your chest. You could try to push further, but your hold over Gale feels brittle. It won't be easy delving deeper without him noticing. <laughs> Let's do it. 15. Well, I got a 19 last time. Fingers crossed. Crit fail, of course. What are you? You're using the tadpole against me. You had no right. None at all. 
I've a good mind to turn around and depart this little company of ours immediately. I'd rather be alone than spend another moment in the presence of someone inclined to such unjustified invasions. If you would just of tell me, second person of narrative, you don't see that often these days. Welcome in, Receiver. How are you doing? Ooh, a plus five. Yeah, we'll do insight. You're in mortal danger twice over. To leave would be foolish, and you're no fool. DC 12, and I got a 16. <sighs> I have to admit, you're right about that. Perhaps my reaction was a tad volatile. The irony of which is not lost on me, though it needs remain so on you for the time being. I hope that the glimpse you caught of my condition convinced you of the urgency in treating it. Can I count on you to give me the artifacts I need? Being able to crit fail a skill check that you have in the bag is funny. Yeah! Really annoying. I don't want... I, I, I think there's a way to change the difficulty like that, because in the way that I've played D&D... Um, crit failing a skill check is impossible. You can fail, but there's no way to crit fail it. So, yeah. The 1 in 20 chance, which happens more often than most people think. I haven't got a single crit uh, success yet, but I have had a crit fail multiple times on skill checks, and it's kind of annoying. I think there's a way to custom change that difficulty. I think you have to do it at the beginning of the game, though. I don't know if I can do it now. Um, yeah, the dice are loaded. One in twenty chance, and so far I've had three crit fails on skill checks, and zero. I have I have had a crit hit for like physical in combat and stuff, but I've never had a crit uh, skill check. Thank you. I see my trust in you was not misplaced. I'm sure we won't have to look very far to find what I need. Faerun overflows with magic-infused treasure. As do our packs, as a matter of fact. Good, now he approves a little bit. Such an item already in our possession. This, this has a lot of the, uh, the moment, the Clementine will remember that, um, effects open. in the game. Oh, and as far as that tadpole trickery goes, I really do trust you'll not be so untoward again. Yeah, I probably won't. <clears throat> okay, so we've got Silver the Wolf... Wrath, Loic, must be a kid of some sort, candles, uh, and the like. I don't think there's anywhere to go over here. Mud. Oh yeah, left alt. Wicker chest. A bone. I think I'll take it, why not? Whoops. Let's see, we got another mugwort. Salt of mugwort. And is there a pure focus? Is there a fire resistance? Maybe another potion. Motion of mind reading I've already made. Coatings, grenades, alchemist fire. Ooh. Fire amber and any salt. Ashes, dagger root. So three dagger root, mix that, okay. Anything else that's not stealing that I can take? Another mugwort. Do the chest there. So yeah, how's your night going? Uh, logbook. Ooh, logbook twelve. How's your night going, receiver? Plenty of that. Uh, what was it? Um, Fortnite harmonics game. The Guitar Hero, but not Guitar Hero. 
Let's see one read this here. This hefty book is labeled 1371 and stamped with an elegant stag against a dark green background. Six Uktar sent two druids, some of the new recruits up north. Um, the village there has had two years of failed crops and are unlikely to survive the next winter. Uh, nine, nine Uktar. Um, a group of from Baldur's Gate arrived. They've had they've set up camp on the edge of the forest. Two bears and a fox came by. Their territory has been burned out. Half of the fox's cubs died. Paying this new group a visit tomorrow. Ten Uktar. The visit did not go well. After telling me where to shove it, they said they'd cut down half the forest and burn out any wildlife that dared to stick around. Claimed they were going to farm the land and make a new city of their own. Time to get creative. 12 Uktar. Mudslide did the trick. Buried half their farming equipment and made the rest useless. They won't be coming back anytime soon. Got reports of a red wizard. Ooh. In the village south of here. Sending three rangers to investigate. If they catch even a whiff of, the, of a red cloak, I'm con... If, yeah, if they catch even a riff of the, of the Red Cloak, I'm contacting the South of Sylvanas. Red Cloaks, that's, uh, Wizards of Fey? They're pretty dangerous. Um, they're not, uh, not to be trifled with, basically. Um, basically the, uh, the bad guys. One of, one of many bad guys, but bad guys within the, uh, the, um, universe of Dungeons and Dragons 5th edition um, Sword Coast stuff and not, and Faerun in general not necessarily for not necessarily just Sword Coast but um, definitely something to worry about usually they're bald and they have uh, tattoos on their forehead and they dress in all red so easy easy way to uh, to tell if you're talking to a wizard of the Fae is if they have um, uh, red cl red clothing um they can disguise themselves, but yeah. Dangerous, dangerous people. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry, I was cleaning off my glasses so I could uh, put on my gunners. Because getting a little bit of a headache. What else was there to check out? There was other things? Wellspring plague. Plaque. By claw and tooth from root to thorn, the old oaks grow to wildling sworn. You recognize Yes, the Baldur's Gate is in the Forgotten Realms. This place is a divine sanctuary. How is how is the text size, by the way? Uh, Megan was saying she was hard. It was hard for her to, to read it last night. Yesterday, yesterday. Forest rose with claw and tooth to tear the darkness from its roots. Druidic orders often fight dark forces, but you do not recognize the events depicted here. The mural depicts a purge, a sacred cleansing of the land on a scale you've never seen before. You seem like evil druids to me. I thought I saw another thing I could look at. Oh, yeah, right here. That mural, they look like dark justices. Yeah, give me the idea that these are evil druids. Darkest hour, a concord made. Twixt harp and wild against the shade. Local history written in riddles. Ah, uh, failed. Damn. Okay, I don't think there's any more plaques that I could read. That one says illegal to read. The towers seized the battle done. The moonrise broke the darkest one. History or myth, whatever of course is I'm depicted failing these here saves. is long past. Okay, well, I guess it's time to leave then. Pretty small game is designed for SD TVs. All right, let me see if I can increase that size then. Um, interface. I'll go max size then. See, and also on my end of uh, my OBS, it looks like everything's running in slideshow. 
Is it for you? No? Okay, it's not. Smooth as butter. Okay. Oh, my, my OBS just isn't running it very well then. Like, my preview window on OBS is running really, really slow. Okay, so let's check our quest here. Find the Goblin Priestess. Powerful magic. Might be able to cure our, uh, tadpoles in our eyes. Kaga wants to keep things gone. Asked you to ask us to guide them out of the grove. Save Arabella, who immediately ran to her parents. We got talking with Shadowheart here. We learned that Shadowheart needs to reach Baldur's Gate to fill a mission for her goddess. Throw the details of that mission are a mystery. Um, Shadowheart opened up to us about her fear of wolves. Pain. Her mysterious wound inflicted upon her. Shadowheart is Bay. Yes. We like Shadowheart. Super good at Fortnite Rock Band. The only issue is that they're releasing a couple songs at once. And I hear they're like five bucks a piece or something like that. Which is kind of expensive. Although I think that was how the price they were. Maybe like three dollars they were on like Rock Band originally. Uh, pleaded her endurance. Though she may be withholding something. Welcome in Jace by the way. Uh, we witnessed Shadowheart react to with alarm to an encountering a wolf. She seems a deep seated fear of them. See, she's willing to talk about it. We did, we did got her to talk about it, actually. Uh, okay, so we that's all early stuff. Recruited Will. Okay, Wizard of Waterdeep. Needs to consume the weave. Okay. Aw, oh, the, the bear's sleep, uh, sleeping. Free for the rock band mode, you buy them using them in creative, which is for nerds and no one cool plays creative modes. I see. I think there's a way to, yeah, zoom out. Oh, okay, that's how you get up close. I think that's where I need to go. Wasn't this where I just came from? Please return. Carlac. Okay. How we came in. The hollow, the kid they tried to steal from us and failed, thankfully. Metallic gloves. I didn't pick those up. Well, now they're now I did. Too many games came out this weekend. I don't, I don't know of any other games that came out. I could be wrong, but what's in the backpack? Ooh, yes, I'll take that. A is for Azuth and other gods six. Fortnite, Minecraft, Fortnite, Rock Band, <laughs> the finals, Lethal Company. Lethal Company came out like 
last weekend, I thought. And I don't know what the finals are. Oh yeah, Zevlar. That's when you talk to this guy. I heard what happened. Thank you for protecting the child. Yeah, no problem. If the druids are this far gone, then it's not just goblins we have to fear. So we can risk violence here, or face it for certain on the road. Quite the choice, isn't it? I'll let you guys decide this one. Uh, new update came out yesterday. I he I keep seeing a lot of people playing it. Um, since I don't do a lot of multiplayer and community things, unfortunately, I don't think I'm going to be playing it myself. Um, but I mean, I hear good things. Five choices. Leaving the grove is the best option. I can help. Can you delay the ritual? You have to resist. Best of luck with that. This has nothing to do with me. I'm not here to advise you. I'm here to make sure you leave. I'm here to make sure you leave. It's basically phasmophobia. And I've heard that was really good, too. Again, I don't play multiplayer games, though, so... I'm not here to advise you. I'm here to make sure you leave. So, Korga's twisted your mind as well. Please, just listen. Sending us out there is a death sentence. But there is another way. If you want to turn your blade on anyone, turn it on the goblins. You won't be able to cut them all down. There's a horde of them out there. But they're ill-disciplined. It's unusual for them to organize so cleverly. Somebody must be leading them, bringing discipline to their ranks. Take out that leadership, right? And they'll scatter. The blade of front. He just really doesn't want us to to, to, to kick him out. That's all. Journey, and we are grateful. But it'll be a short journey if the goblins still own the road. So I have to go and kill By some trial, goblins. There is only one correct answer. Refuse him, and we sentence these people to die. Can you pay me? I'm a druid. I don't care about money. Well, I do, but I don't. Um, yeah, I'll kill him. Everyone in this camp depends on it. Gale and Will Thank both you. approve. Nice. We'll be ready to leave as soon as you give word. No, sir. But if there's a clear path past those goblins, they'll find it. Yes, of course. I feel like there's another exit over here somewhere. But I don't see it. The devil you know in autobiography. All right, let's go ahead and leave here. <clears throat> Where else do we need to go? Okay, so we need to go down here somehow. That's north. Should be a path over here, I'm hoping. I'm not seeing one, though. I'm there to discuss this. Wait, let's discuss this. Okay. I mean, he talks about killing some goblins. Goblins aren't bad to kill for me, so I don't mind it. How do I get over there? Is there a way to climb up here, maybe? Yeah, right here. Although I can't go that way, can I? Oh, what's the window's key? Whoops. I didn't read that plaque. What does this one say? This grove is kept by Sylvanas's faithful. This game is multiplayer. It is. But it's mostly a single player experience. 
There must be a way to climb this. Or get around this or something. Can't get here. Oh, C. Too high. Oh, I can't jump. Must be another way around it. Teleported out here. Camp and a resting menu. Let's go ahead and go to camp. We have a companion that we didn't necessarily bring with us just yet. Take a long rest, fully heal your party, and also manage party members' advanced relationships with your companion. Store items to eventually change your character, recruit more followers. There's the guy I wanted to talk to. So. We're traveling with the famed Blade of Frontiers. I feel safer already. Tell me about yourself. Oh, what's to tell? I'm a magistrate back in the city. It's all rather tedious. I need your party to travel with us. Uh, sorry, but I prefer groups that are a little smaller. I think you can have only four people in your party at once. Lose a follower or two, and I might consider. Uh, I said something. Yeah, you can only have four people in the, I think, at once. He's dressed like Captain Marvel. He's also a vampire, if I remember correctly. Magic mirror. Pick your party member and dwarf toss them up there. That would be that would be fantastic if we could. Unfortunately, I'm probably the strongest person that we have. Change our appearance if we want to. I think this entire game can be played with just a mouse, which is probably not a bad thing. I'm going to talk to Shadowheart for a little bit. Blade of Frontiers. Let's hope Will lives up to his name. We'll need all the help we can get. Those murals in the grove, something about them seemed to catch your eye. Yeah. What can I say? They were eye catching. Consider me an art lover. Across the water? No. Talk to Gale if you wanted to. Or Will. There's a stone bed. Leave camp. Okay, let's go leave and leave camp. Alright, so I think we want to go this way. So we want to go east. Is not no, we want to go west. Was a time I tussled with hill giants without breaking a sweat. Now, a mere werebear could swap me halfway to arm. Strange things are happening to us. What festers in our minds may well impel our bodies. This is 
is, I think, where we want to go. Oh shit. People up ahead. Something's wrong. Yeah, something's wrong. Let's go check it out. You're a true soul. You can't die. Please, stay with us. I, I don't think he's conscious. C can you hear us, Ed? You, not a step closer. We have healers. Glows, but you feel nothing in response. Your illithid power is beyond reach until you rest. His wounds look deep. I might be able to help. DC 10. Yeah, there we go. 14. He's hurt badly. An oil bear got him deep. If there's anything you can do. I'm watching you. The injured man locks eyes with you. A familiar squirming churns in your head. Your minds intertwine. You see his siblings, Andric and Brenna, new recruits, yours to shepherd. Protect them. He is a true soul. Mind him. He will. He. He. Oh, Ed, no healing please. apparently happened. He's with the absolute now. You're, you're a true soul. Edwin, our brother, he was chosen. Like you. Do you have orders for us? We were reporting to Edwin. Ooh, seven choices. I want to say forget the owlbear, you're still like, go. I kind of want to know more about this absolute, because that's what the goblins were also talking about. Encoded, overloaded. Turned down... Uh, so I am having issues. Game is running fine, but the stream is having issues. Okay, let me see if I can change something here. Oh, why is that so high? Let's try 5,500. See if that helps a little bit. Um, I can't see the frame rate, but it, it says it's running at like 70. I can try to like maybe limit it. Um, yeah, let's limit it to 60. Okay. I can take that back up to... 6,600 then, 6,500, or 6,000 it was. Yeah, let's, let's uh, do the absolute explain. What? Are you, are you testing us? The absolute is our goddess. She's going to rip down the old world order, start a new one. Then we'll be the ones with the power. Well, you will firstly, Trussel. You don't need me to explain that. A true soul, like you, has been chosen by the Absolute. You speak with her voice, and when the time comes, the true souls, you, will rule. That fellow was infected like us. Is this the mark of a true soul? Hmm. 
Forget the Alberry soul lives and go. Well, and and just leave it. Shut our prunes. I suppose he'd want us to go on. Find a way to honor his sacrifice. May the absolute guide us. They spoke of the absolute. Same as that goblin, Saza. Curious. Yeah. A cult from the looks of it. And word spreading fast. I doubt he's anything worth looting, but let's check his body. Strange power resonates within the corpse. It calls to you. its host's memories go to waste. The tadpole has absorbed it all. Its experience could nourish you, strengthen you. Wisdom. Force your mind shut. You will not be influenced by the by an illithid parasite. DC 12 with a plus 3. Of course, I ran a four. Even with my plus three, it's only a seven. No use. Compulsion takes over. Your actions are no longer your own. Those things lives in my brain. Okay, so we just got some more quest things here. Tiffany's make the way to the village gate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, met some cultists who, wor who worship a deity called the Absolute. One of them could telepathically communicate with us, which means they were infected too. Okay. Some suggestions. The wizard wonder. Or how about the master of the weave? Funny. Tempting. But I think we might already have the maximum number of theatrical titles. You might have more titles. Have you seen Game of Thrones? Can I cross this? grass to pick up. Owl bear tracks. Its nest must be nearby. Ooh, an owl bear. What level are we? Level two. We might be able to take an owl bear with the four of us. yet. Pickaxe and an eviscerated go goblin. That stench. Dead owlbear prey, no doubt. statue of some sort down over here. Potion of animal speaking. That could be useful. Uh, distressed. 
Okay, um, let's go get that uh, potion of animal talking, speaking. Can I go this way? I can go up and go that way, okay. Of honor. That's what I was saying. I don't know who it was, but. Potion of healing. Animal speaking. Scroll of Protect Thoughts. Glass Chalice. Incense. Everybody's feeling. Okay, so that was a bad idea then, huh? A dusty volume that speaks of the conflict between the sibling goddesses Saloon and Shar. After Saloon ignited the sun and brought life-sustaining light to warmth and warmth to the universe. Okay, so that chest I don't want to interact with. I definitely need to heal though. Because that hurt quite a bit. Fifteen damage it did to me. Is that potion of animal talk speaking? Quake of its heavy footsteps before you see it. An owl bear, its beaked face looming out of the darkness. What's this? Something weak, something tender. Won't even have to chew you before I feed you to my son. Soft meat. You're injured. There's still a spear, half a spear lodged in your head. It's a splinter. I've got a bigger threat than you with worse. You need rest. Let nature heal you. This is no time for a fight. Please. Oh, it's a TC5. Come on. I've got a plus three. Don't, just don't crit fail. This game does not like me. I've still got one good eye. That's all I need. Well, this is going to be the end of this game. Yeah. Unfortunately, you're right. Concentrating. So now I'm gonna hide over here. Can't afford to let up. Do you have any distance attacks? Inflict wounds. Heading there. Not enough movement. 
Oh, it's melee. Oh, what? Oh my goodness. has quite a bit of health left. Alright, and Battle will is the fearless. Eldritch Blast. Making a move. We're going to die. What path lies before me? Of course it's saved. Back here. Six. I'm just doing another bolt to it. Okay. The blade will not bend. That takes an action. Take a healing potion. Creator, destroyer. Of course, I missed. On Victor's path. Okay, um... Quickly now. Let's finish this. Take you. 
so much for peace. chances. We might actually still kill this thing. God damn it. in action. Uh, huh. right, let me heal and then I'll attack this thing. Death won't take me yet. Eleven damage. Alright, let's do will. His dead mother. Hey, she attacked us, man. We tried to talk to her. Wake, hungry. A single strike will end his suffering. For the best. The cub would have died anyway. Nature might have provided her. Too late now. Should get some rest. I need to keep sharp. Head of a broken spear. Don't waste the step. Open up. Oak Father's Embrace. Parkloin. Maybe I need more pockets. What you gonna do? Care in your pocket? Owl bear eggshells. An unhatched one would fetch quite a price. Oh, I see. Yeah, let's go ahead and make a long rest. You have enough camp supplies, restore all hit points and spell slots if you a long rest. Yeah, let's just go to bed. Auto select. sleep well, flitting between dreams and nightmares. Maybe you wake up because you know something is wrong. Or maybe you just get lucky. Shit. No, no. It's not what it looks like. I swear. I... I wasn't going to hurt you. I... I just needed... Well, blood. There, in the dim firelight, you see him for what he really is. A vampire. A slave to sanguine hunger. How long since you killed someone? Days? Hours? I've never killed anyone. Well, not for food. I feed on animals. Bulls. Deer. Kobolds are people. Bulls. Whatever I can get. But it's not enough. Not if I have to fight. I feel so... weak. You haven't fought anyone. If I just had a little blood, I could think clearer. Fight better. Please. 
A strange sensation courses through you, and your companion's mind unfolds, secrets half revealed. Why didn't you tell me? <laughs> At best, I was sure you'd say no. More likely, you'd ram a stake through my ribs. No. I needed you yeah, to Yeah, and you me. trying to bite me in the middle of my sleep. And you can you, I can trust, trust you. Trust me. Yeah, you tried to bite me. How can I trust you? Because we don't have a choice. Not if we're going to save ourselves from these worms. I need you alive. You need me strong. Please. Only be a taste. I swear. I'll be well. You'll be fine. And everything can go back to normal. <sighs> All right. But go too far and I'll drive a stake through your chest. Ah, of course. I shall be gentle as a babe. Let's make ourselves comfortable, shall we? The only way to cure this is through a wish spell, so... It's like a shard of ice into your neck. A quick, sharp pain that fades to throbbing numbness. Your breath catches, your pulse quickens. That's enough. I guess I'm gonna get a crit fail again on this. Oh, okay. I got a nine. Hmm? Oh, of course. That. That was amazing. My mind is finally clear. I feel strong. I, feel I learned last night from Jace that this character is voiced by Heisenberg and Nikolai. This character, uh, voice actor. I don't. That felt wrong. Ah, don't be so dramatic. This is just a little transaction between friends. And look what you've gained. Together, we can take on the world. I, I know what the right answer to say for this, but I... Yeah. I hope so. I look forward to seeing you fight. It shouldn't take long. So many people need killing. Now, if you'll excuse me... You're invigorating, but I need something more filling. This is a gift, you know. I won't forget it. You watch as he stalks off, stronger, more confident, ready to hunt. <laughs> I had a star to bite you, ouch. Got a trophy, uh, achievement for that. Bloodless. Feels a bit woozy. Minus one to attack, roll saving throws, and ability checks. Oh, great. Thanks, Astarian. Appreciate that very much. Where is the bastard at? I just know he's not really a bastard, but... I won't have a word. Good morning. How do you feel? Woozy. It'll pass. Just be glad I'm not a true vampire. A bite from them and you might wake up as a vampire spawn. Like my good self. All of a vampire's hunger, but few of their powers. Is that how you can stand in the sun because you're not a true vampire? Oh no. I should be cinders in this light. I hadn't seen the sun for 200 years before we crashed here. Someone, or something, wants me alive. 
I can see the scars on his neck. Standing in the sun, wading through a river, wandering into homes without an invitation. They're all perfectly mundane activities now. As for my other quirks, well, <laughs> we can figure those out in time. What's causing this? The Mind Flayer's parasite? That's my theory, but who knows? I'm just glad you're being sensible about these uh, revelations. I was worried people might turn up with torches and pitchforks. Although there's still time. Hunting with vampires. Never thought I'd see the day. Very well, but I'm keeping an eye on you. And no wisecracks about having us for supper. Oh, and a quick word of warning, Astarian. I taste absolutely awful. Keep your distance. Enough, we need him, like it or not. He's not wrong. We're bound together, no matter what comes. You say all the right words, but I'm not so sure you mean the right things. Still, I will respect the decision that was made. There now. We're all friends again. Shall we go? There's a long day ahead of us. All right. Go ahead and leave the camp. Definitely need more potions of healing. Here we go. I saw you training those children. You were so gentle. That's not how I was taught. Oh, there was no exit. Strengthen neither heads nor hearts, Shadowheart. I wouldn't quite say that. I learned a lesson, after all. Ah, uh, this is where we gotta go. Came to resent your tutor, I bet. I taught them to fight, not to hate. <clears throat> Let's have a look. There's a dog that's walking around a dead corpse. Because there's not such a thing as a live corpse, is there? The shock about a starian. Ha <laughs> ha joke. A goblin looks like a goblin from a distance. Reach out to pet him. Plus four. DC of ten. We'll try it. Eleven. There we go. Fifteen. The dog lowers his hackles, his head tilted inquisitively. Convinced that you're harmless, he turns his attention back to the corpse. Around his neck is a collar etched with a name, Scratch.
with a deep, heartbroken whine, the dog bows his head. The dog whimpers nervously, as if to urge you on. He's got blood on his paws. The dog looks at his owner with sad eyes. He does not move. Hold out your hands, we can follow your scent to camp. The dog sniffs your hand, his tail swung low in understanding. He knows how to find you. Anything around here we can check out? Besides Gomwick? Personal note, soft letter, tough letter, gold. Guess we're taking it all. Okay, let's look at these letters. Gomwick, be doubly careful on the way back to Baldur's Gate. I receive more reports of, an, of attacks on travelers throughout the region. I can't have my best messenger winding up face down in a ditch somewhere. Watch yourself. Better late than never. Postmaster General Danzo. Well. Unfortunately, we have uh, bad news for Danzo. David, it's a boy. He's perfect. He's healthy and perfect. I named him after his father. Come back and see us as soon as you get leave. Okay, so these are letters. Nine fingers. I won't come back to the city while not while you have your thugs looking for me. If you want the debt paid, you have to trust me and collect it yourself. Go to the graveyard and look for where a M. Kerwin is buried. Get digging, you'll find enough valuables to settle matters between us. Don't go looking for me, I'll know when I'm safe. I'm gonna put that on. Okay. What else is around here? Not a whole lot. Sixty XP for what? Something over there. Here it would seem. Got some people over here, it looks like. So, Will, what was the Blade of Frontier's toughest kill? Ah, it was a great scrap. A hungry minotaur with a hankering for human flesh. An axe bearing mountain of fur, she was. Gave me a nasty Is that the one on your eye? You don't mind if I don't ask to see it. Damn it. I wish we could at least have given them a proper burial. Thought you was busy with the foul bloods in Elson's Grove. The goblins need to be dealt with, so I'm dealing with them. Bet you will too. Just like my mates here did. Contract cleverly left out, we'd be tits deep in these buggers. Looks like you were ill prepared. Don't know what I expected. That much gold for some long lost relic buried in the arse end of nowhere. And from a wizard, too. I should have known. The gold probably turns to lead the moment you leave Boulder's Gate. A stupid thing to die for. Let's say I want the gold, where would I find the relic? It's called the Night Song. It's supposed to be hidden under the temple where the goblins jumped us. I'd give you a map of the temple and wish you a happy funeral. But my mate Brian kept hold of it like his own sodger. Goblins made sure to the fat old chunk. 
When he saw the map. Oh, got the contract. Can show you where we turn back. If you feel like dying. Thanks, I'll take it. <laughs> Don't thank me. I'll be well on my way to Baldur's Gate when you die. I'm just glad to be rid of the bloody thing. Happy hunting. Come on. We're wasting time. You guys are leaving potions of healing on them? I mean, I'm gonna take that for sure. Crimes. Quarter staff. Goblins. Rogue's morsel. Backpack and deep tieflings. Something waiting up ahead. Okay. No, 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 this way. Wow, I wanted to go that way. Okay, I'm gonna take a quick break. I gotta go to the bathroom. So, will with a why? 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 That's right. <laughs> but why? 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 A great uncle. I'll, let him, I'll let this finish playing, and then I'll go but to the bathroom. I just figured he couldn't spell. That's it? Okay, good. Okay. Do that. Do that. And then... Run an ad. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back, but um, yeah, it's still running, so I'll wait for the ad to finish before I come before I go back to the game. Okay, 
Ads over. Let's go and get back to the game. Might as well save. Okay, so there's something up above here, and I remember seeing Jace do this before. I don't see. Oh, there's a thing though. And these things have stayed interesting. Get over there! Surround them like. I know you're there, show yourselves. Actually, let's keep quiet. Oi! You just walked into the wrong town! Don't bother running. My archer's got decent aim and plenty of arrows. A strange symbol glows marked on their flesh, and something within you stares in response. Persuasion, Intimidation, plus two. Spare them the trouble and just let me pass. I'll be gone in no time. Ugh, it's a DC 15. Damn it. Oh, okay. Here we go. I'll take it. 18 success. Oh, suppose it's best to save our strength for a real threat. Go on then. Just keep your nose clean. Yay, we gained experience. What's checking out here? We don't have a rogue on our team. See that? The inking is rough. A work in progress, surely. Oh, that there. I'll take that. Open up. Nothing in it. Of course not. Ooh, a tourmaline ring. Let's leave. Let's let them have their fun in there. That fire's been going for quite a while. It's fresh. A 
should have opened the door. Yeah, I'll, I'll let them keep their fun. No need to interrupt. Auto save. I don't like that. I'm trying not to do as ma as many um, manual saves as possible and reloads, but something else. Have a shovel. I thought I had a shovel. Was I mistaken? Does somebody else have the shovel? Here I thought I had a shovel. Should mind my step. few warlocks in my time. Talented, of course, though sometimes too eager to listen to the devils on their shoulders. <laughs> Comes with the territory, unfortunately. I think I have a Myers That respect. is most gratifying to hear. May I? What happens to the item should I give it to you? I will consume the magic inside. What was a powerful artifact will be rendered no more than a trinket. But it will save my life. Even if only temporarily. I guess I'm gonna have to give him my gloves of power. Thank you. Sure it did. I can feel it work. The magic, it's like a lullaby that sings to sleep the demon inside. A metaphorical demon, I haste to point out, but no less dangerous. And no less bound to wake up again to continue its ravages. Such is the nature of all monsters. Perhaps now you'll tell me what this is an aid of? Grateful as I am, the course of our camaraderie is much better served by not taking that particular detour. Not just yet. Sincerely, though, I understand I ask a lot from you with few answers in return. But in time, all will be told. I hope I don't regret losing the artifact. It could have proven useful. I myself am a much more powerful artifact in your arsenal. Rest assured of that. I'm going to say that so far against that uh, Owlbear, Will was the one that was the best. Oh, you can level up. Level three druid. Okay, I learned some more spells. Bark skin, dark vision, enhance ability, flame blade. Ooh, that's nice. Flaming sphere, also really nice. Spike growth, gust of wind, heat metal, hold person, lesser restoration. Moonbeam, 2d10 Radiant, passes out trays, that's really good for our stealth checks. Protection from poison, spike growth. Let's 
to heat metal. Four on health. Improved warlock spells. Okay. We can also get a level two spell. Um. Cloud of daggers is always really useful in my eye. Darkness can help though too. Scorching Ray. Let's do Scorching Ray. Pact Boon. Pact of the Chain. Gain the service of familiar, a face spirit. It takes the form of your choosing. This can be an imp, animal, or closet. Pact of the Blade. Summon a pact weapon or bind the one you are wielding, making it magical. Pact weapons use the wielder's spell casting modifier instead of strength or dexterity. Pact of the Tome. Your patron grants you a grimoire called the Book of Shadows, which allows you to cast Guidance, Vicious Mockery, and Thorn Whip. More spells would be nice. We're going to do Pact of the Tome. And replace spell. No, I think we're good. He's got 20 health now. the class features. Spell slot, two spell slots. Okay. Um, let's see here. Scorching Ray, we already have someone who has that Ray of Enfeeblement. Phantasmal Force. Concentration. Magic Weapon. Acid Arrow. So tactically 64 damage. I think we're gonna go that one. That's something useful. You missed a step. I know our cleric. Let's see, we gain two spell slots and a bunch of spells to choose from. More spells to prepare from. Prayer of healing. Yeah, that's good. Where am I going, by the way? We can talk to them? I need a quick word. Something tore right through these people. East reeks of brimstone and offal. Every breath is thick with blood. You hear what comes next before you see it. The sharp snapping of bones. Oh, this isn't good. The yelp of pain as her body starts to twist and undulate. You watch with cold realization. This isn't the end of one life, but the start of another. Gnolls, vicious, monstrous humanoids can spawn from the corpses of dying hyenas. Well, let's kind of kill it. Destroy the abomination. You land a swift strike against her skull. She yelps, then goes still. As the life fades from her eyes, the null within her dies too. Stillborn. We don't like we don't need nulls. Oh. That is a lot 
of hyenas. It's really only one, but. Watch it! That hyena's going for help! Um. Go ahead and tangle that. At least walk up to it though. My faith will protect me. No mercy. Walk a little bit further forward. This is my time. Path of that erupted. miss two steps at a time nothing will stand in my way have a cantrip. Firebolt. No choice but to keep going. Oh no no. Go back to him. Death is but a word away. On my way. Now. Or was it firebolt? Good enough. Oh shit. Thirty feet coming through. Or I'll just blast you. How is that a miss? Ugh, damn it. I speak, they burn. Striking distance. are gonna dash. Oh my god, we're gonna die. Take bonus actions or reactions. Oh, yeah, because so 
close range. save. Every time someone uses Sacred Flame, the person that's using it is, is saving. <sighs> Concentration broken. That's not good. One card be a gentleman. Don't I have magic missile somewhere? Thought I had magic missile. I knew it. God damn it. Oh, come on, the criticals. Much longer. Five is better than nothing, I guess. No bloom, all doom. Damn it. Inspiration point, hey. Eh? Whenever a character performs an act that's true to their background, they gain experience points or receive inspiration. Six turns remaining on Shalali. Advantage. Can I hit one of you guys?
I hit E for quite a bit, that's good. Come on. Wow. I don't even get to use the stupid bear thing. Just kill me already. Just end the end the thing. What, what can I do? Fine then. I guess I'm just gonna hit everyone with this. Yeah, this is ridiculous. Okay. Who would have thought Knowles would have been so hard to fight, huh? not go that way. Wasn't there a sigil that we could have gone to? Sigil we could have gone to around here somewhere. Where did I see the sigil at? Waypoint, yeah. Finish that quest, maybe. Oh, our level ups Road didn't save, did they? A long one. Who knows how long it'll take these folks to get there on foot? If they make it, they're slow, vulnerable. Half or more will die long before Basilisk Gate. Seem to trouble you a jot. What good would it do for me to be troubled? We can't save them all.
was fine. Your mother was a half away from twice. Okay, cool okay. Let's go see if we can talk to Nettie. Patiently. This may be catching. There. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now, what was it you needed? I'm looking for Nettie. You found her, but I still don't know what she can do for you. Do you know anything about mind flares? Why are you asking? Something crawled into my eye. Did it look like a tadpole? But from your worst nightmare? All slime, teeth, and tentacles. What other kinds are there? It's not like a frog hopped into my eye. That's a serious condition. Come, follow me. I might be able to help. We need to be quick. This way. Ooh, secret passageways. This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. Is everyone being captured by mind flyers these days? Didn't think it was a common experience. Rather too common as of late. At least that's what Master Halson suspected. A pity you got me instead of him. He understands these things. Studied them. Still. We have options. You don't have to be here for this. I'm interested in the procedure, actually. Please, go ahead. All right. Let's see what we can do. What's the plan? Will it help? It might. But first things first. Tell me about your symptoms. Have you noticed anything strange happening? Looking closer, you recognize the branch. And it's no druidic cure. She's holding Kalimvor's kiss, a briar from the Dale Lands, and a deadly poison. What is this? I came to you for help. I want to help you, but I can't unless you work with me. So, has anything unusual happened to you? An intellect devourer spoke to me as if it were one of my own. As if I were one of its own. Recognized you as being infected. Well now, that's something. How do you pick up the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. On a mind flare ship, I was kidnapped and infected. A mind flare ship? But Mr. Halson was sure. Look, you've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. If you transform here, we're all dead. But you seem like a good soul. You deserve a chance to save yourself. This is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. More poison? I would have preferred a cure. I don't have a cure. Only a way out. I'm sorry for misleading you, 
But I had to be sure you weren't a threat before I told you everything. Now, do I have your word or not? All right, hand it over. Swear it. I swear. I hope it doesn't come to that, but thank you. Here. You know, I've spent my life treating folk and never once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly, there's dozens of you. Maybe more. Master Halson and I were tracking them, studying them, trying to figure out what the Who's hell was in? going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flayers out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. What do you mean, should be changing? Mind flayers reproduce by infecting someone with their parasite. Seven gruesome days later, the victim transforms and a new mind flayer is born. The thing in your skull, though, it's different to anything in our records. It's one of their worms, for sure. But this one gives you powers. Telepathic connections. And it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. Well, I've already taken one long rest, so we're at day two. You said you were tracking other victims. Have they changed? Hard to say. But there's a lot we don't know. Infected, folks like you, have been converging on an old temple of Saluna. And I've no idea why. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. You still think he's all. He's th you think he's still alive? I think so. I hope so. I've sent birds to find him, but they can't get close without goblins trying to shoot them down. You, though, you're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean, they won't kill someone carrying their parasite. If you can find Halson and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. How's that sound? <sighs> Sounds like you're making a lot of assumptions that could kill me. The way I see it, you have two options. Halson or that wyvern poison. I don't envy your choice, truly. But this is the hand fates dealt you. All right, I'll find help. Thank you. It would mean everything to the groom. To me. I wish I could tell you more. But only those adventurers know what happened out there. All I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. And Master Halson didn't make it back. Good luck out there. And if things start to go bad, Remember the vial. Remember your oath. Okay. So now we got the wyvern toxin. I could coat myself with it. They tried to poison us, but we managed to talk her out of it. She let us go. She made us promise her to kill ourselves if we started the turn. We have to go rescue. Halson now. The uh, night song is a temple in the goblin camp. Yeah, and the story bit me. Whoa, what? Something in that vessel. Take a closer look. Dream visitor. Wait, what did it say? Mine. The goblins still infest the road. I wasn't trying to talk to you, as but long okay. As their leaders live, Zevlor's people are trapped. Is 
it's nutty in here. Okay. Something over there. A deep crease in the spine makes the booklet fall open to reveal one recipe in particular. Neat writing in the corner marks it as an antidote for all known potions. This is it, the recipe that made me decide to publish my notes. The story might not interest you, but I shall record it for posterity. For posterity, feel free to skip the actual to the actual recipe. I was sitting in the Elf Song, sipping my usual hot cocoa, the heat soothing the pain in my scaleless hands. A small child, human, stumbled through the door, sick as a dog. All the other patrons seemed like they wanted to help, but nobody could pay for an incident for the stranger's child. For a stranger's child. Meanwhile, the ingredients were just lying around in the kitchen. Every single one of those people could have saved the child, but only I knew how. It felt like a crime. Recipe 1. Recipe for one bottle of antidote. Extracts needed. Salts of mugwort. Suspension of bullywog trumpet. Slowly trinkle the salt into suspension. Stir clockwise until the concoction's consistency turns almost chewable. It might turn slightly green, but this is purely aesthetic and has no effect on the antidote itself. And remember, when in doubt with alchemy, just recall the rule of three. Thrice the same ingredient forms an ex excellent extract. H. Thank you. Potions. Antidote. Salt of mugwort. made an antidote. Check out the cliffs over here. While we're there, we'll level up. Again. Should I say that you're leveling up? I think I wanted. What did I go with before? I don't even remember now. Metal, that's right. <sighs> okay, I think I went with him. A scorching Ray. I think we went with that.
I wonder if they have set health. They level up. Um, I think we went with... Cloud of Daggers. Misty Step. Trace. I think we were okay with everything that she got. Now we'll go ahead and save. Okay, so I don't think we went. Which way is that way? This way. A hero at heart. I don't know what you saw. What did you see? Checking things out. What you saw the ball song? That's cute. Something over there. We don't have a shovel to open that, so. twice as tall as me, but I'm half the bloody backbone! But we don't know what that thing even is. And what about the crypt? I'm telling you, it's a ship. And the crypt can wait. Mari and Barton have been trying to break in for days. Now we... Stop! Got ourselves competition already. That's our ship. Oh, I get to be him. That ship's a full of po poisonous vapors. Probably demonic, I'd say away. Poisonous? What? See? That thing could be carrying a plague for all we know. We're, uh... We're leaving. Come on, move it! Gale and Shadowheart approves. Nice. You're more cunning than you look. I thought we had a fight on our hands. I thought we did too. What's this now? There's something underneath here. There's something underneath here. Sorry, I didn't read that. Dang it. A 
this way. There we go. No. What's up here? Anything useful up here? Yeah, the wooden crate. No. Kind of feeling it looted at all in here. Oh, can't go that way. Okay. Uh, some food in there, I'll take that. This is a new territory for me. Where I haven't been up here, have I? Zoru was right. Yellow is a toad. Oh, twice hey, look. as ugly. It's the thing's dangerous. Lizelle. Leave it for the goblins to kill. And if it escapes, how will you? Oh. A guest. Your skull pounds in response to the prisoner's white hot stare. Her lips don't move, yet you hear her voice. Get rid of them. Yeah, shoot the trap down. We must kill it before it harms someone. get a crit fail. Okay, good. He's right. No one's safe if that thing goes loose. Not even us. Danae's? Enough. Lower the trap. Ready your blade. You've but one chance. Join me or die. You lying rat! Of course they get better. damage. Wonderful. Be on my way. Let's end this. Welcome in, Megan. How are you doing? Been kind of quiet tonight so far. Let's 
see. You just went shopping for a few things. We're out for a couple hours. Run around the block to see in the lights. I uh, went grocery shopping myself. Drained my social batteries for quite a bit. And then, uh, yeah, um, now I'm playing this. Can I hit her? Yes. Battle favors the fearless. Well, we didn't get to save Lazelle. I'll move as far as I can here. Breathe deep and move. I miss. On my way. And then sacred flame. Right there, as far as I can get. The last board is set. With haste. Firebolt. Them. These boots have seen everything. Critical hit. All right. Got to focus. On my way. Always save on a stupid sacred flame. <laughs> what is the point of this? I understand it's my turn. She's gonna keep running away. Have to keep going. Well, we don't get to save her, unfortunately.
we're not that far from it, so we'll just keep walking. We didn't leave her to her fate, she died in the fight. Yeah, we need to talk to these guys, don't we? Seems like a good moment to talk. You ever scare me like that again, and I'll feed you to a knoll. We don't yeah. like knolls. Knolls are I'm bad. Fine. Stop it. Our little hellion told us what happened. Thank you. Don't know what we'd do without her. No more light-fingered antics, right, Arabella? Yeah. I mean, thank you for helping me. Stealing the idol. What were you thinking? I was trying to help. You knew how to hear me. What would your mother and I have done? Okay. So that's that quest completed. the blind village. What time is it? Almost. Okay. Here goes nothing. There's a lot of things. Oh, potion of healing? Yeah. Suspension of Lacolite. Okay. The ledger is filled with cultivation instructions for a range of medicine, medicinal plants. One entry is underlined. Deliver spe specifically requested plans, plants to the seller. Keep away from prying eyes. It says there's a seller here somewhere. I don't see one. Dagger root. More dagger root. Extract the rule of three. a way to the cellar sort of right there. Anything of use? It's 
Something the matter. I wasn't trying to talk to you. No. On death resurrection. The healthy books. Gladiatorial sandals and more rags. It looks like it might be part of the cellar. The first one of this game came out in 1995, like, and it doesn't play anything like this at all. I have them. I have them on Steam and GOG. They don't actually relate to each other. Besides the fact they take place in the same universe. That's about it. I could be wrong in the 1995, but it's it was in the 90s. For sure. Close that, but that's doing me no good. Let's move the mouse around and see if I can find the thing. Cellar. Guessing this right here is how you get to the cellar. But I'm guessing not because I don't see it. To the tracker, maybe? Keep your paws to yourself, and I won't cut her off. Hmm. 
I don't know how you would find the cellar. Let's have a look at myself. Ha ha, that's funny. I got it. I don't like, I don't have a I don't I don't have a clue. Okay. Um That's a bad place to go. All right, so we need to go to fly. Stop this thing! <laughs> Flap those wings some more and I'll feed you a worm. Oh man, it's and time you. to end stream here too. Hope you got a stomach for rights. I'm not looking for trouble, I just want to pass by. <laughs> Funny. That's what our birdie wanted. Release me this instant, you beasts! Unless you want to join him up there, you best pay the toll. Chop it up! I don't even have... As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. I'm not going to pay anything. I'm going to pay nothing, and you and your coins are going to leave. I could still fail this. But I did not. You're a true soul. I didn't know. Wouldn't dare question you. Never. A shiver runs across your mind. You feel sainted. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll leave you to it. Let's find you yeah, get out of here. All right, then. Fresh meats. Scared meats. All right, you guys all have some conversations to talk to me about here. By the sundering, the parasite allows us to influence others. A power born of elephids is not one to take lightly. It may prove sin or salvation. Such powers of manipulation could be useful. If it makes our enemies more valuable, all the better. Actually, I'll let you guys decide. 
The options are, such powers of manipulation could be useful, and if it makes our enemies more malleable, all the better. Option two, if this power comes from parasites, it can't be trusted, however useful it might be. And option three, these things are strange, these are strange times, and even stranger powers. We should seek to understand them before we make any rash, rash decisions. So you guys can make the decisions here. Final decision of the night before we go to bed. Before I go to bed. Because it's 8 o'clock p.m. my time. You can actually click on the screen, and there should be a little thing on on the on the stream that lets you choose. Little pop up, pop up thing. now yeah there it goes should say vote for a dialogue option there you go yeah you got it well chosen never dive into unknown waters without dipping a toe okay and now we're going to go ahead and save here really quick. And we're going to call it, because it's time for me to go to bed. You like that? You'll be able to decide decisions and stuff like that. And you should be able to see like the quests on the left and stuff. Like You can see the party if you look over the left. You can click on the little party thing and see all the party members and go through the inventory and stuff like that. Um, see your quests, all that stuff. Kind of out of it. Oh, okay, I gotcha. That sneeze is telling me that it's time to go to bed. So I'm gonna head off. Didn't understand before. That's alright, no worries. I'm gonna head off to go to bed, and I will see you guys later on this week, possibly. I'm not sure what I'm gonna be playing. I'll figure it out. Um, gotta get that Resident Evil, uh, mod working a little better some of the textures are missing so yep have a good one i'll catch you guys later peace out